headphones off. Stay over there. I am with another freaking. Anybody, anybody, where y'all at? Another freaking video, man. I know y'all hear me, man. What's going on, man? Bring me back with another one, man. Y'all didn't know solo dolo right now. Hey, but you know what? We got more cookies. And more cooking, man. We got South African Got Talent 2015 with um, Noe So Mandinga. So I guess this must be like a comedy where somebody won a, a comedy stand up. So let's get it. I want to see it. Let me hear. Let's get it. Make sure y'all can see it first. I know you. No. <laughs> Most of the time, someone says that you owe them money, so no. <laughs> Your name, please. Luisa Matinga. What are you doing for us today? I'm doing stand-up. I'm a stand-up comedian. Let's go. go Let's okay, go. Cool. Good to be here with you all. Um, I'm a big fan of interracial dating. Big fan of interracial dating. Let's go. So, what I've found with interracial dating is... I, I hate how people take the little pause like, oh my God. Let man, let the dude get a joke out, bro. Let him get, let the joke come out first before you start oh, oh, you know, hating or whatever, man. Let go. That's right. When a white guy dates a black girl, he goes for top notch. He goes for the black girl so hard, black guys are like, oh, you got a good one. <laughs> a black guy dates a white girl. It's like we're taking the ugly ones off your hands. It's like, It's like black guys just go up to a group of white people and go, hey, are you guys going to no? Okay, cool. It's very easy starting an interracial relationship. Because what I found in this country is if you're a person of color, it's hard to hit on a white girl if you have an accent. Ma'am, over there, what's your name? Jane. This proves that she's white. <laughs> if you're a person of color, you can't just go up to Jade on some... <laughs> Hello, nice. <laughs> Hello, nice. <laughs> Baby, I love you. <laughs> you know, you hit me ding dong. Because all Jane is thinking is, oh my God, I'm being mugged. <laughs> 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 this is so wrong. You can't even go up to Jane on some, hey, you want hot thing, eh? Hey? Like, hot, hot, hot. Why don't you give me your number? <laughs> I'm thinking is, oh my gosh, that is the silliest accent you've ever heard in my life. <laughs> <laughs> you guys, thank you so much. You guys are such a lovely audience. Oh my god. Is that not the best community you've ever had on the show? On the show, yes, yeah. for sure. Yeah, for sure. Alright. <laughs> I like that, man. That was funny. That was funny, bro. Bro. Come on. That was funny. <laughs> I like that, man. That's how you know. See, when you go out and do shows like that, you have to be good at what you do. Because some people are quick to judge, quick to respond, not really slow to speak and slow to listen. Um, they, I mean, quick to listen, slow to speak. They go right into the judge. So you start opening. Dude, you got to be funny in like the first few seconds, man. Um, I wonder if this how he got his his break. Like, so this is 2015, this is years ago. So I'm assuming this is how his, his break popped off. Y'all probably know better than I do for sure. But that was pretty funny. He has that he has that calm stand up voice. So I can't wait to go do his whole Netflix special. Um, yeah, and I want to see all the because I've only seen so that's a two minute and a four minute Netflix I saw of it. So I want to be able to sit there and watch it all the way through and get get the whole feel of um, how funny he is. And I'll be the judge because your boy no funny. I have always been a comedy junkie, so I'll be the judge of that. So man, we're gonna keep on rolling on with this on there, and I'll see y'all in a minute, man.